Hey everybody, we're here with Ted Lang from The Love Bones. Soon we'll be making your dreams come true. Come sit down here, Okay, Ted. Okay, so baby, tell me. What do you want to know? I want to know. I can't tell you that. What have so you I'm been at, doing <laughs> since The Love Bones? Since The Love Bones. See this? I write plays. And I've got a thing called the Footnote Historians Trilogy. There are three historical plays about African Americans in great moments of American history. Going down in so, history. Yeah, so Wonderful. what happens is they don't tell our story. If they do tell our story, we're a footnote. So I call myself a footnote historian, and I tell the stories of African Americans in history. Ooh, but you are so <laughs> fine. She's fine, ain't she fine? But anyway, that's what I've been doing. So I write plays, and uh, I direct television, and uh, you're I, directing. What yeah. are you directing? Oh, let's see. The last thing I did, I did for Byron Allen. I did a thing called uh, First Family, which was about uh, a black president, half-hour sitcom. And another show I did was called Mr. Box Office. And that was with Bill Bellamy. And uh, we did that. And, you know, Telma Hopkins is here. Oh, I know. Oh, we're, that's where we're going right now. We're going yeah. Well, tell her I said hi because God. I directed her. Do you want me to tell her come over here and come see him? Yeah, <laughs> tell her. Tell her come over and come see him. Well, I'll tell you better go but, over here. Uh, uh, we, we did Are We There Yet? I directed her on a half-hour oh, sitcom. Are We There Yet? Are We There Yet? We got to remember that. Okay, yes. Yeah. So I talked to her about it. She, she was know? great. We had a good time. She's a great lady. So now the love boat. Tell us a story about the love boat. How'd you get that part? Uh, I was because that is your part. Everybody knows you. Well, from thank the love you boat. very much. And if you have to remember, kind. you don't even remember the captain. Yeah, you yeah. remember Ted. Yes. Go ahead. Ted. Well, um, I was doing a series called "That's My Mama" on ABC, and then I did another series that didn't last very long called "Mr. T and Tina," but. The one successful character on Mr. T and Tina was me. So they didn't even audition me. They just interviewed me. Writing. Yeah, they said, we're going to do a show about a boat. Do you get seasick? <laughs> I, what does an actor say when there's a job offering? <laughs> I, I don't get no. seasick. So I know how to ride motorcycles. So yeah, You're exactly. I'm good. ready to go. Let's, <laughs> let's rock and roll. So uh, that's all we did, and that, that was it. And um, the first, they didn't know how to write for me, so the first real big episode that was written for me was written by Fred and Bernie. Fred Grandy and Bernie Coppell wrote my first episode uh, oh on the love boat. They, it kind of gave the guys an idea. A little twist. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Nice. How are you? Well, such a successful show. We all watched it. We all loved it. And we all love you. And we still remember you. Wow, and thank you. when it comes to the love boat, we love Ted Lang. Listen to that. Come down, see me. All right. Can you just do your watching the Jerry and Louise show for us? You're watching the Jerry and Louise show, baby. Thank you. All right. Have a great day.